G'day guys and welcome to part three of our Rogue Tech run through. Uh, last time we got our butt beaten hard. So we're just going to do a quick check again of our mechs. Uh, we lost half the thorn and also I believe he's engine if I remember correctly. Uh, yes, we definitely did. So there's not too much we can do with him right now as we don't have an engine to replace that. Uh, we've got, oop, wrong button. We've got a vehicle now as well, the Ignis, uh, which we can now see what we broke on it. So it looks like we took out the left flank. Uh, luckily our propulsion system tracks can just be repaired. Uh, but it looks like we've lost a vehicle flamer and some Inferno ammo for SRMs. Not very good, but we've still got normal AX warheads. So, not too bad on that part. I'll see we'll get that repairing oh, so we can use that in the field. And let's do a quick check of our pilots. Uh, oh, they're still fatigued, so we won't worry too much about the skills right now, but we did lose one pilot, so one of these guys will have to step up. Uh, we'll have to have also what the guy who can use a vehicle. He has hard case already unlocked, which is pretty good. Uh, don't have any other skills unlocked at the moment, which is a pity. But at least we've got one pilot that can vehicle a vehicle. Drive a tank. Excellent. All right, well then, in that case, we're just going to spin until we're good to go for our next mission. Hopefully she doesn't take too long. Looks like we're going to get our training module upgrade. Hey boss, we've just completed those upgrades. Thank you. Excellent. So we can go straight back into engineering and we've got 4.6 mil, so we can look at what we're going to upgrade next. We can do some structural upgrades to unlock some additional upgrade points. Storage space might be good because it reduces our upkeep costs a little bit. It's only 400 costs a or 90 costs actual purchase so we might actually go with our storage space All right, I'll sounds like a good idea right away. close down our passive costings and we'll go back and continue to spin the wheel well we know about flashpoints now that work order you submitted is complete All right. Now we've got our tank operational, so we can look at our next mission. Let us head into the command center. Okay, so we've got a flare-up. Uh, I'll see Burrito looks like they're trying to launch an offensive on Terra, which we definitely can't let that happen. So as we're trying to still join the Comstar, uh, we're going to join the Comstar side of the flare-up. Uh, we'll see how we go. Don't know what the first mission is going to be. We're just going to start. And notifications in one day. So it's not too long. And we're going to launch that mission. So it looks like it's a battle in the Badlands. Uh, via the Overflow. It's a one skull mission. Which is a little bit more difficult than we'll be doing. Even though we got it last time. But payouts are good. We're going to go for more salvage. And we're going to get out there on the field. Alright, so. We've got. Some pilots. Clearly indicating that this is a training mission. Uh, we're going to throw. Our commander back in the ring. With the spectre. And then we're going to use our vehicle with our one pilot that could we field it luckily there's some bigger mechs so this should help definitely with the mission uh we as long as we keep ourselves alive we're not too well see we want to keep these guys alive as well but not too worried about them taking damage because we won't actually have to pay for them which is pretty good so let's get out there command interface initiated all righty so we've definitely got a trainee mission. Uh, oh gosh, I'm really excited about this. I hope 
see some fighting. I really would not want to do some fighting, but I'm not sure. We didn't do very well in the practice range. Just because you always blew up the observation bunker. Anyway, Commander, I'm seeing a single Cretan Lance. With real guns? I can't wait. I'm gonna lick their asses. I I interesting term? Yes, kick. Have fun, Commander. I'll be on station meet here. We're ready to look. Oh, radio. You know, the guy just turned his radio on, too. Oh, it's windy. Now we're going to ruin our senses of vision. Okay. So, there's our future evac. And the Cretans are up on the point up here. So, we could use the water to our advantage for cooling. As we are in the Badlands. At the same time, we don't get much cover. And the edge of the maps are here. Okay. Hmm. Don't want to deploy on the other side of them. We might actually deploy where suggested. And push across the water, keeping ourselves cool. And doing whatever damage we can. So, we'll open our box. Okay, so we've got some battle armor. We've also got a spider. Uh, some more battle armor. I believe that's all they've got. They'd have to have one more or more for a lance, I'd say. Possibly, maybe. It matters too much. Alright, so we've got a Battle Cobra with two large pulse lasers. That could be very mean to that spider. We'll get old Burger Time up front. I'll just brace for now. Standing by. Uh, we've also got a Chameleon with an ER large laser, a medium pulse laser, and a medium laser. Good weapons. I'll throw him more on that flank. See if we get any new sensor locks. No, we do not. Okay. Hold the line for now. Okay, spider's getting close. Waiting for orders. And Mr. Pontoon is in a sentinel with a gorse rifle. Small laser, medium laser. Interesting, no missile system. That's okay, we're gonna. Run him forward into cover. Ten four. E, sorry. Run her into cover, and we're just gonna Get up defenses. Waiting on you, Commander. Okay, so our tank, which is missing one flame, which is not the best in the world, but those flamers and the MG would be great against these battle armors because they'll take additional damage from. Them. So we're just going to... Can't really go through the water here, it's too deep. And we have a path up here. The one battle armor, so we might actually get... Can I get there though? I can if I go along the front, so... We'll move the vehicle along the front, and then up this path to try and engage this battle armor. Yeah. And our sentinel, we will activate our ECM. Just move on up. Get everyone Roger. covered. Embrace. Alright, yes, yeah, so they are in the three unit. Confirmed by the box. There's a status log, so. I'm receiving you. Well, now we're playing for real. Let's get our sentinel to find a position to shoot. You can't kind of shoot from there. Must be a, pretty much of a divot. Could reserve. Was it nine? No, all my guys go first. So we'll do two into the water. I don't believe it's going to be a very good shot. But we should still be at extreme ranges where. They can't hit me reliably. 
I've got 16 rounds, so we're just going to fire one off. Fortunately, we missed, but eh, 10% wasn't really the best shot in the world anyway. Orders. Okay, our Battle Cobra. I think we just sprint to our Battle Cobra up. Closer. We take this position with the cover. We should have some good shots. And if we get too hot, we can just dump in the water. Affirmative. I we think we're still out of range for most weaponry. Yep. Oh, we can hit with the large laser. Trying to see the best spot. Can we keep ourselves in cover? Confirmed. A point nine percent. Well, if this hits, I'm gonna go buy a lot of ticket. Nope, <laughs> didn't think so. All right, let's see what the right, the BA moves forward. Receiving you. And we can get our chameleon on the flank. Just trying to come back in again. And we'll also take a hot shot at the spider. Oh, 13%. The uh, large laser might actually hit. Nope. It will not. But the spider definitely knows he's being engaged. Assume he's just going to move forward. Oh, it doesn't even shoot at me. I hear you. All right, we're going to keep getting our tank to move around. Going turbo. If nothing else, if he pulls fire away, be all good. Okay, so they've got reinforcements, I'd say. The hostile ship. So I'd say there'd be reinforcements. Yes, commander. Not the best thing, but acknowledged. Let's see how we go. Yeah, now we got some better shots at this spider. He has a broken energy weapon. That's actually good to know. Ten four. Oh, we miss. Fortunate. Failed to connect. All right, they're gonna move battle armor up. What do you need? I'm going to move my specter up. Copy that. I'm gonna take some shots again. Well, these are pretty good shots, actually. Oop. We'll see what we can do. 25% chance for the mediums. Oh. I'm not generating any heat because I'm in the water. So Take we'll this. see how we go. And we miss with everything. As is the standard. Negative damage. Waiting on you, Commander. And right, our tank continues to flank. Although they've got that dropship drop in there now. Might be a better idea. Pull back, reconsolidate. If it wasn't for that hostile dropship, I would have continued with the flank. Ready for orders. Alright, our battle cobra friend. Can you get in position for a straight shot? I think it gets the same move. Oh no, it will be closer. I guess better Position of a standard move, so we'll just stand and move up and fire our pulse lasers. Which don't generate any heat because I'm in the water. Lovely. Oh, and we got a hit. And some more hits. Oh, we also got a head hit. The pilot's now injured. And he's bleeding out. That's good. That makes him have to waste a turn at some point or Ready for just order. auto eject. But it's a spider, so he shouldn't be able to eject. We're running the correct quirks, but I haven't really used a spider in this mod. But we'll see how that goes. Uh, also, put some Confirm. more fire on him. Oh, we're now internal. Lovely. The spider is most definitely going to run away. Although he's back to me now. Oh, and he fell over. <laughs> Causing another wound. Crystallion marking. Okay. Let's 
Well, they might be able to deal with that BA over there if they're hostile to it. Yep, they sure are. Well, best way to win a fight is to be the third one to arrive, so... We'll let them play with each other. And we'll just hang around on the flanks out here. Okay, so they've got a locust. Don't know what their other lance is. I say it's a 3v, so it'll probably have machine guns and a laser. Spider's fallen over, so we can deal with that. What's up, boss? Just keep progressing okay. over here. And if we stay near our evac zone and just take pot shots and force them to come to us. We might be very well off. Alright, so cold shot because the spider's fallen over on his chest. And oh, we get a single hit. Standing by. Could have done a lot there, but I'll take at least one hit. Move our chameleon up. And we will do the same. Roger. Nope. Obviously, we're still staying cool because we're in the water, which is great. Negative damage. Obviously, I'm I here. don't know what their cooling's like on these mechs. We've got 14 rounds left of this course. No, I'm not too worried about taking a shot. Get to see it hit. Attack fails. I hear you. And we'll just run out up. through the water. Pedal to the metal. Yeah. And then making sure we keep all our guys ECM covered. Let's move. See if we hit them in the chest. Oh, we do. And yeah, we go internal too. Lovely. Our new for enemies uh, out in the flank doing things. Looks like they're in an off scout by the feedback. Do they get a chance to actually see? Uh, yep, so there's an off scout there. That's not too big of a problem. There's only one energy system. Waiting for orders. Usually a medium. Well, we'll keep harassing this spider for now. But if he wants to go engage Gastellans, that's fine as well. On it. Oh, we got hits. Oh, got another hit. Hey, and the spider has ejected. Which is a very interesting thing to say. Being <laughs> the cockpit on the spider by law cannot be ejected. <laughs> Well, we'll go with it. Okay, so we can move up and gorse rifle the Oscout. Won't be a very good shot. I think we're better off engaging this battle armor. And let these guys play around with that battle armor. I don't know what their third is in the lance. But it might take a while to deal with that battle armor. Because I know how long it takes to deal with battle armor. Roger. So we'll engage this guy, the uh, Inner Sphere Standards. And we'll let them play around on their flank. Ooh. Interesting. I think the last of their lance is a battle armor via all that. And via the clanks. So I think we've got battle armor fighting battle armor at the moment. Receiving you. Just keep moving up. Oh, someone got knocked down. Interesting. And whoever got knocked down is now bleeding out. It's still an unknown entity. Yep. 
But I would say no. Got it. No shooting, just running. Just gonna keep moving up on this flank. Okay, so the Oscout's going to shoot the locust in the back. Cool. What can I do for you? I would say no. Got it. Max There's speed, no shooting. My tank goes submarine mode across the water. <laughs> That's a very interesting bit of terrain I'm looking at. Okay, so we're doing more warm attacks. Oh, someone has died. Oh, so there's a raid in there. I think that was the... Battle armor I knew about. I think. I'm not sure. I don't know exactly what's going on over there. Standing by. Did I add a shot for a second then? Oh, over here. Don't think it'd be very good shots. Six percent, yeah. Instead, we'll just moving at full keep proper. moving towards this spell armor. Yes, Commander. All an air. See what we can do. What up do you here. Need? I think there's a ridge. Yes, yeah, so there is a ridge. That's why I can't see their battle armor. Confirmed. All right, we're getting closer. Okay, Stan is now moving my way. Uh, their locust moved. I don't know where he's gone. I hear you. And our submarine tank continues his path. Ready for orders. Million can get a shot. Do I want to harass the O scout? Okay, won't give me a readout to tell me what the shot's like. Standing by. We're probably better off just getting up. On it. Anything else, we can always fall back. Okay, so the locust did a thing. Commander. Don't know what it was, but it did the thing. Roger. We got our battle cobra up. Okay. Now the battle armors move forward. Uh, and someone's engaging the locust and hit the Oscat at the same time. I think it was a battle armor because the Castellans have lost a person. So that battle armor, yeah, so that's definitely the battle armor that was there to begin with. And it's now engaging the Locust and the Oscar. Ready for orders. Interesting. In the meantime, I need to get rid of this battle armor. So I'm not sure what they actually destroyed, because I never saw it, and it only came up as question mark. Be interesting to see what it was. Okay, so these guys have energy weapons. They'll have battle claws, that's for sure. But we've got some okay shots. We're gonna generate a little bit of heat now that we're out of the water. I don't believe anyone's in cover. So we'll just see what we can do. Try and Pink their armor down. Roger. Well, that was good hits, they were. Very good hits. Yes, Commander. Alright, we can get. Hopefully, I'm some there. fire on from the Sentinel. Who's yet to hit anything? Uh. We won't waste the cores, or will we hit It's the best chance to hit. Got 13 rounds. We use the course for now. Fire in. Ah, we didn't hit. Sentinel keeping up <laughs> the normal no appearance. I can't hit strike. anything. What can I do for you? And our submarine continues to move. Tempo. Let's see what the Castellans do. That's the Oscouts. 
fired his laser. I don't think he hit though. Alright, and we'll get a sentinel. I want to get too close. Not so much for the weapons they've got, more for the battle claws. I don't want them swarming me. And oh, it's still run cool, even after firing the large laser. Spectre is a very good. Acknowledged. Oh, we got some good hits. We've done some structure to them too. Standing by. Well, let's get this battle cobra up. That. Hopefully, we can continue our trend of hurting these guys very well. Yeah, okay, there's a lot of internals. Okay, we dropped one of them. That hit something good. There's three in the squad. Not entirely sure, but they tried to shoot at me then. I'd say small lasers. If not micro. But they're in cover now, which is annoying. Okay, Locus is on fire apparently. Okay, they've done some damage to that battle armor. I'm here. Okay, so it's gonna get interesting. They're in cover now. Again, I don't want to get too close. Okay, I can get a shot there. Good. Order acknowledged. And we'll try again. Acknowledged. That sentinel still yet to hit anyone, but those were very poor shots, so. I missed. I won't hold him uh, against two of well. What do you need? Okay, so I can get in a position where I can shoot at these guys as well. Which is something I don't want to do. I don't want to be in their line of sight yet. Okay. Good shots on these inner spheres. Copy that. Oh, we got. Oh, we killed another guy. Excellent. Got him down too. <laughs> Uh, they're still firing over there. Waiting on you, Commander. Perhaps our tank will get out of the water? Nope. He's doing a lot. Receiving you. Alright, so. Can you position. Do an attack at these battle armors. Well they are very good shots. We might turn off our medium laser. Because also the pulses have a better chance to hit because it fires three times. Got it. And I won't be generating too much heat that way. Okay. The cover's very much in benefit to them. Let's say so we've got the locus on the move. Don't believe he hit them then. Okay, we're being fired at again. But no damage is best damage. Meanwhile, the Oscout's being machine gunned and flamed. Waiting for orders. And having the time of his life. So we can get shots off if we go here, apparently, with the battle. Cobra. Good try. On my way. Okay, 25s. Here it comes. Do. Oh, nice. Very nice. Excellent. There should be another one down. Yep. There's only one left in the squad now. Target's taken a critical hit. Waiting for orders. Uh, we will... We leave the center for a moment. Get the chameleon to attack. On it. 
Not from the rear yet, because it wasn't a solid green line, or... But... Those are my K shots. It's in a downward angle, so we shouldn't be hitting our Battle Cobra. I will generate a little bit of heat. Now, let's see how you handle this. Okay, good. We got some armor hits. Lovely. At the same time, we can now move the Sentinel a little bit closer. The Sentinel is not very good at shooting. Fire in all weapons. That's still, still have yet to hit something with her. Yep. And hopefully, my commander can finish this. Heading out. Getting a bit close. But we'll see. Okay, so some good hits. Okay, yep. Yeah. Okay, so we got it. That's a battle armor gold. So now we're just going to deal with the Castellan and battle armor over here. Where they have taken damage, that's good. I hear you. So my tank finally got itself out of the water. All right. Standing by. And now we can use this hill to engage. We'll have a bit of cover. We can cool our guys off a bit. Not that they're running too hot, but... Oh, I think they just swarmed. Yep, they just swarmed that os... Yeah. Alright, okay. So there's a gyro in the engine crit on the Oscout. Receiving you. Hopefully we can Confirm. get some shots at this locust. They're not very good shots, but we're actually cooling, though. Oh, he's got no medium lasers. They're both broken. Interesting. Locking on target. Well, we hit him. We destroyed his right arm. Did they get rid of one of the machine guns? Yep, definitely got rid of one of the machine guns. But he's down to one machine gun, which would be his right arm. Yeah. Excellent. Moving to position. Okay. Move the spectre up. Now we can either shoot the Oz Scout, which is a very good shot, actually. And we might hit the battle armors that are swarming him. So I'm not particularly too worried about the locusts with one machine gun. Yeah, there's, there's just too good of shots at the Oscout. Firing. Okay, well I did hit the Oscout. But only with the medium laser it looks like. What's up, boss? Or the small laser. We will get the set all moving. Away. Oh, sorry, the battle Double cobra time. moving. Waiting on you, Commander. Uh, keep moving our tank up. And then they've got a turn with their locust, who is running away. Wants well, nothing to do with all this. Battle armor are uh, still attacking. Oh, there was a gyro crit and an engine crit. And yeah, the pilot's ejected. Lovely. So they've still got four battle armors there. What do you need? So if we can deal with this locust, and then we can just gun the battle armor down as they slowly move towards us. These aren't the best shots, but following a fire, something might hit, which it does. I'm receiving you. Now we're gonna sentinel. Confirmed. Let's see if the sentinel finally hits something. Confirmed. Nope. 
Negative damage. Repeat. Negative damage. Uh, yes, yeah, it's certain will hit someone. This locust is going to keep his invasion really high all the time. Although he did just give the rear to the vector. Yes, Commander. All right, so we will move Coordinate our battle cobra up as well. Get some side shots at the locust on the side that has the machine gun still. Giving them everything I've got. Oh, we got some hits. Did go internal. Didn't break anything though. Ready for orders. And then we'll use our chameleon to pour some more fire on him. Also on the right. And also has got eight health left. Okay. Okay. Well, we hit something internal. I presume it was a leg. It was a leg. What can I do for you? I don't like how close that is to the battle cobra. We'll just move Got the tank it. up here. Back speed, no shooting. Yet to fire the tank in anger. Waiting for orders. Alright, so Sentinel can engage the battle armor. See how we go. Nope. Okay. Still doing the same as normal. Ready for orders. Uh, we will move the battle cobra up. Copy that. The locust still only has that one machine gun, so I'm not too worried about it. And we will attack. Oh, we got some internals. We might have destroyed one. Yep. Yeah, so one of their squad is down. They're down to three. I think I hit something good. The locust is going to continue to move closer. The machine gun my tank. Is that it? I'm barely scratched. Receiving you. There's a choice. The chameleon is now behind you, Mr. Locust. Uh, generate the heat. Wow. I hit with one pulse. Yep. This gets better. I'll do what I can. Alright, so we might as well turn our ECM off. Because I do think it affects our friendlies as well. Well, that should only be for enemies. No, we'll leave it on. Let and we'll rest. gauge this battle armor. Dripping more armor. I hear ya. And our friendly tank. Got it. We'll get to do something. Hello, Mr. Locust. I have a lot of weaponry. Affirmative. I seem to have broken some of your heat sinks. There's more where that came from. Oh, okay. I'm apparently in the battle armor range. That's all you got? They're only machine guns and flamethrowers. But it could be a worry. Okay, the locust is going to help me. But it doesn't hit. Yes, Commander. Could be an opportunity for the Sentinel to actually hit something. I think I'm inside range of the gorse. So we'll just fire the small and the medium. Taking the shot. <laughs> we still miss. Oh, doing very well. I missed. Yeah. We can get rid Got of this it. locust, then we can focus everything on the battle armor. 
attacking from position. Oh, okay. I can't hit the locust now, apparently. I missed. Standing by. Okay, well, we won't fire the, at the locust from there. Because we're bound to hit the spectre. Instead, we'll fire at the battle armor. Confirmed. Firing. We don't hit anyway. Well, luckily, but, well, not luckily, but at least we don't hit our friend. Commander. Alright, Mr. Battle Cobra. You have a kick available. I think we kick the locust. In the rear. Because we still fire our pulse lasers afterwards. And we just hope we don't send his... Uh, engine critical. Got it. So we'll do the kick. Which we miss. And then the pulse lasers. Blow the arm off. Blow the torso off. And eject the pilot. Yeah, because we had no weapons left anyway, so the only thing you could do was ram me at that point or kick me. What can I do for you? So, get rid of the locusts. And now we've got the tank to engage the battle armor. I don't think he'll have very good shots where he's not, so we're just gonna stay put. Receiving you. Location confirmed. And then start pouring on some fire on this last battle armor. Roger. Oh, there's a hit. Oh, there's another hit. So that battle armor now has no armor either. I'm here. Copy that, Commander. And sentinel forward. Will we hit? Target locked. Nope, we still don't hit. <laughs> sentinel keeping up 0% accuracy. And then battle armor's... Oh, it hits me once with a flamer. Five heat shouldn't be much to the battle cover at least. Waiting on you, Commander. We'll get the tank up. No need to tell me twice. And we'll fire with everything. No sweat. Nice. Destroyed a yeah. machine gun. Critical hit. There have also been acid hits, so they'll be generating heat. Although I don't Ready think the bell armors get hot. Uh, move our chameleon up. Uh, we won't fire our ER, so we can cool off a lot. Attacking from position. Oh, we do get a structural hit. Break another machine gun. Target's taking a critical hit. What do you need? We will move our spectre up. Let's move. So we'll be ECM jamming them now. And fire everything because we don't I'm generate heat. Shot. Oh, definitely kill one. So they're down to two in the squad. Blunt. And better Cobra's hit him a couple times. That's okay. Standing by. She'll get her revenge now. That's a 28%. That's also 28%. Probably want to move where we're a little bit further oh. away from them. And then we'll take our shots. Oh. We dropped another one. Give them everything you got. We've got one left in the squad. Some heavy and I think I only have to hit it with a machine gun. Because I've got a slither of health left. By. Absolutely nothing Hi. left. Will the Sentinel hit? Can the Sentinels be the hero of the day and kill the last guy? Will it happen? It happened! That's the last of them. All primary targets down. Everyone's down. We've done it. Well done. You've managed to wipe out the op four. Tracked you right now. Excellent. 
Well, that was after the last mission. That was an extremely good mission. We only took a little bit of armor damage, and I think it was only on the one-use rookies as well, not our actual mechs. So, I expect for the Spectre. I think the Spectre did get hit by a machine gun. Yep, so we destroyed the Lance and the Castellans. We get some extra payouts for that, which is great. I get a 10% increase, obviously, because everyone survived. Uh, we had a 77,000 drop cost. Uh, we used 13 grand of ammo. And our heat sinks and coolant costs was 16 and a half grand, which is fine. And Krita takes three points loss in the flare-up. So lovely. So I'm not too worried about these first three pilots because they won't mind anyway. We gained 700 XP on our commander. And 600 on our pink yeah, driver. Commander, whatever you want to call him. Is good XP. Uh, for our salvage, there is an engine core. We might grab the engine core just so we can get the uh, thorn up and running again. I don't believe there's any oh, there is some stuff that we can straight out take. Don't know how damaged the spider was. So he lost his head. He's got a damaged machine gun. Okay, so it's just the head. Interesting. I believe the Oz Scout only has the one laser. Oh, it's because it's bought three, but only had a meeting and it's broken, so we're not too worried about him. There's nothing else below. Or so we could grab the spider as a backup. Supposed to be better to use than our Mercury. Yeah, we'll, we'll grab the spider. Uh, we will grab... We might need some heat sinks. I don't know if we have any spare heat sinks. And we'll grab a standard F, uh, fire control system, because if the spider's head's destroyed, it'll probably only be basic. We will disassemble everything, just to make sure. Oh, there's a 280 engine. I don't remember what the other vehicle had. The 35 ton inch engine though. I believe it was only like a 160 or 170. So we'll, we'll go with the 170. We'll confirm this. We've got some locust parts, a Raiden parts. And I'll see what we took. So, pretty good salvage, especially with a spider that we can put together. That mech you wanted is back online. Okay, so, yeah, we got our spider. Only 300 bucks worth of armor cost, that's great. So, our next flare-up mission will be in three days. So we will have some fatigued pilots. Although we got other pilots, but that's a story for next time. Uh, thank you guys for watching yet again, and hopefully you join me for the next run. I will see you there. Uh, like and subscribe, and yeah, we'll see you then.